During this video, we're going to show you, as you can see, the Airhawk going through a doorway with a door that is just 27 inches wide. Very, very narrow doorway with an old house in a very narrow hallway. The key to success here is we're going to make certain that the Air Hawk is on the lowest speed. I'm going to do this without even touching any doorways or anything like that. And you can see as I'm going through the doorway, I want to keep the joystick as close to the door as possible. I don't want to bang my elbow on the door or anything like that. Easy does it. I'm going to go straight through the door and when I feel that the edge, the outer edge of this would hit the wall before making a turn, I'm going to start turning on the joystick. Nice and slow, easy does it. I want to bring this outside edge almost to the point where it would hit the wall but not quite hit the wall and there you go I'm out the door I didn't nick anything I didn't nick either elbow I didn't nick the door I didn't nick the floor very simple very easy I'm going to now go in a doorway as well just as narrow I'm going to navigate through some furniture I bring the unit to the point where it comes close to the actual furniture I have a dresser here, I have a sofa here, and then I turn at the last minute, and there you go folks, that's how easy it is navigating the Airhawk in very tight, very narrow spaces.